What's up, it's Los Santos Serif and welcome to Project Cars. Today I'm driving with this Mercedes-Benz AMG GT sports car. I don't know, this is luxury vehicle slash sports car. Looking very good from interior. As you can see, I'm making a quick tour here how the, how the car is looking inside. And then we are gonna put the car on gear on and let's get on let's drive through this california highway but the main thing the main reason of this episode is definitely not this mercedes it's about talk about project cars 2 so i want to i want to talk about that game because it's been silent for uh, approximately year for now so what has happened what happened when they promised uh, the slightly mad studios released uh, announcement in 22nd of June 2015 that Project Cars is oncoming. That was only a few months after the original Project Cars was released on PS4, Xbox One and PC. So the first reaction what people have was they were mad because Project Cars were after three months release of the game it was still buggy and laggy and there were several issues of course uh, main, main issues has been fixed right now and the game is running pretty good I like it so much I think that's one of the greatest simulation games available for now Assetto Corsa is also one of my favorite, but these, these two games are pretty fantastic simulation racing games. So the Project Cars 2 were announced one year ago and people gone crazy. They wanted to have a DLC package to this game, which happened. There is new cars and new tracks. Not so many, only few, few, few new tracks and, but the cars, they, they have plenty, but the, the release schedule was not so uh, frequently like in most game, most cases of most games, in my opinion. And now the game of the year edition came out a few months ago and it covers everything there's all the new tracks all the new cars more than 120 cars and this vr mode which i'm playing right now and this is very awesome it works pretty nicely making this game one of the most intense vr driving games available but yeah let's talk about the project cars 2 I'm a bit tired of Project Cars already and I want to see more. I want more and Slightly Mad Studios promise us certain things to coming up with Project Cars 2. And let's go with those cases. Uh, they promised that it will be the largest track roster ever with 50 unique locations and 200 courses including loose surface racing on dirt, gravel, mud and snow. And they all have dynamic time of game and weather, allowing to players play anytime, anywhere. That sounds fucking awesome. That's the, that's the thing what I want. I want to drive rally tracks with rally cars and even, even try to uh, drive like this AMG on loose, loose dirt like like travel or snow that would be awesome and let's hope that there will be ice on the road and we can really put the cars and our driving skills to the limit that would sound very awesome then they promised us the widest variety of motorsports with eight different disc, disc keep lines including rallycross hill climbs and touche I don't know what the fuck is Touche, but more than 200 cars and 40 different vehicle classes, including 
never seen before, never before seen concepts and even banned race cars. Hell yeah, those banned race cars, they are definitely very, very interesting because they have power. They have so much power and we are not seeing those too much in the games. Of course, rally games like Dirt Rally and Sebastian Leb Rally and those always include those basic band like basic band rally cars like Peugeot 205 and those old B-class rally cars. They are awesome, but I want to see more. There is like like plenty of more band race car we never seen in games. At least 20 of those. So that's what I'm expecting to happen. Then one mo most interesting thing in multiplayer series is that you can play co-op carrier with your friend even driver spotter or co-pilot I think the co-pilot means rally so you can be the co-pilot and read notes and stuff that would be awesome there will be more strategy, strategy greater risks and greater rewards I don't know what the rewards might be because in this original project cars there is not so much those reward things. Then there is promising to be seamlessly connected driver network, but I'm not too big fan of that because it always requires internet connection. Shit. Yeah. Then there will be pro esport racing, live broadcast and stuff, but I think the esport thing is the thing in current version of Project Cars. So that would be quite obviously. Uh, I don't know what's the situation of the game right now, because they announced the Project Cars 2 over a year ago, and we haven't heard anything. And what was the... Oh shit, what a jump! And the most suspicious thing of this is that it will be group funded, like the first one. This game was group funded, it turned out to be working very nicely and then Namco Bandai, Bandai Namco, whatever that is for nowadays, bought the license, give them feedback to this Slightly Mad Studios and now the game published very big audience and it sold over a million straight away it got huge success uh, but that's what I don't know why the Project Cars 2 have to be group funded I don't know why the Panda Namco Namco Panda whatever that is ain't funding that because they should have plenty 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 of money because Project Cars original has sold so much sell so good people like that some people hate the bugs but I think the most of those bugs are fixed right now um, I don't know so I'm, I'm going to hope that we are going to see Project Cars 2 and we are going to hear more in the near future but I oh shit I'm driving like a fucker oh my god I waste my new AMG, fuck, but here we are, here we are, race completed, alright, I hope you were enjoying this strange episode, and please give a comment, what do you want Project Cars 2 to include, so, yeah, your thoughts, I'm very interesting about those, and if you want to see more, of course, press the juicy, red subscribe button and give a like rating as well if you like this type of content so we're gonna see you at the next episode have a good day bye bye